What is that rig? This is a modified CQB rig that holds 18 magazines. 18, and when did you M4 use this? Max. This would have been from probably 95 to 2003. Did you get shot at wearing this rig? No. Did you shoot at anybody wearing this rig? No. So for anybody who's asking, this is a, the SOE rig that was made for me in 90, just after Somalia, because the way I was carrying my magazines in Vietnam deuce gear wasn't really working for me. So this is, this is 18 M16 mags, okay? You got two pockets up front that hold two each, and then two pockets on each side that hold three. Four quarts of water, plus a bladder, plus a butt pack for any, any essentials. Now, mind you, during this time frame when we were wearing this kind of kit, we weren't wearing body armor. Um, snipers weren't required to wear body armor. That didn't come until much later. So we were still kind of patrolling around like it was Vietnam. Uh, but this worked for what I needed to do and how many mags I needed to carry. And contrary to popular belief, it's not that heavy. You guys need to man up. That's this rig. So this would have been the, this would have been the older rig. You can see it's kind of, uh, it's got that different, it's got that 19, 90s type of woodland which is which wasn't wasn't the best but it was the best that you could do back then it's got a waist belt butt pack four quarts of water there's two pistol mags on here so you can hold two pistol mags uh, it was it's a good rig it's still a good rig i mean this thing's 20 years old it's been all over the pan pacific area so this rig here was a custom one we did up for Jeff. It used to be that you would buy a CQB vest, which carried two mags per pocket, or a patrol vest, which carried three mags per pocket. We put extra pockets on this so that instead of four pockets, it has six mag pouches. These vest panels used to open forward right here. <coughs> These Velcro open right here. This is how they used to open. Now we've got a zipper here. Um, as far as the modular LBV that we're putting out right now, um, no pockets, obviously. Panel set, same size. Shoulder panels, shoulder pads are identical. Back panel system is identical. Uh, butt pack is improved a little bit. There's a few extra features. These are slotted for horizontal pistols and horizontal utility pocket like this one. Um, now they have Velcro, and these pockets here are fast text. There's no Velcro in here. All the new ones have longer lids. Um, by new, I mean in like the last 20 years. They've all got Velcro Fastex, and the lids will Velcro in the up position here because this has Velcro here on it. Also, having the Velcro, we were building these long before uh, Malice Clips or Molly Gear or any of that. So everybody used to 550 their uh, uppers in place or zip tie it in place, and the Velcro just kind of gave it that little extra so it wouldn't shift. Um, the Hydro Carrier still clips in the same way and then has the straps the clips on the side here um, the, the shoulder panels and the back panel are identical still um, the only difference is what we're putting on the face the butt pack is uh, changed a little bit but that's it um, we now have pals on the side instead of just the two inch slotted webbing for Alice clips um, but the footprint of the rig we're making today is identical to this you can see the hydro carrier had two inch uh, bars on there for Alice clipping things on there, whereas now we've got uh, modular gear. But that's that's about the only changes. This is just for you COD guys. This is a, a US Molly kit that I had that I wore for a little bit of time when I had the fast attack Jeeps. So this is 10 mags. So that's all the Molly, all US issue, 10 mags plus three pistol mags. Um, Two quarts of water, first aid kit, no big deal. Just regular Molly stuff. And then this is kind of what I'm playing with now because I'm working on uh, uh, Tavor transition with transition with the Tavor, so I need a lot of magazines. Uh, and so this is 18 magazines, two, two, eight, two, and two. It's a chest rig. Uh, it's it's pretty it's pretty thick, but again, it's all about what you what you need. Also. You know, it's got this zipper pocket right here where I keep all the first aid gear. I could probably drop one of these mag pouches and put some water or something like that. I don't like to put anything, 
I don't like to put anything on the front that you don't use to fight with. Um, so uh, first aid or first aid is okay because it's in this pocket. Uh, water will probably go on the belt or somewhere else. But again, I'm not I'm not running and gunning with this. I'm trying to do a train. I'm trying to learn how to use the Tavor uh, in a in a more fashionable way, I guess. And that's a eight max stack chest rig. Eight max stack with chest rig. Four. Nope. It's got two CQBs and yeah, no, they're, they're all CQBs. So yeah, they're, they're all CQBs. CQBs. And then um, you have. You got kiwis in there? I have kiwis in there. And they fit right in there, no they problem. Fit, they fit right in there, so that keeps the mags and do the ammo in there. Do they Velcro in place, or how do they? You know what? I don't I don't think I had to Velcro them in. I don't remember. I this together They're so just long tensioned ago. In They're there? just tensioned in there. That's cool. Or maybe, nope, they are just tensioned in there. Right on. So and you never there. pull a mag out and the kiwi comes with it? Nope. Cool. I would just use, because it's got the Velcro in there, I, I think I talked to you about this a long time ago and you're like, put a Velcro disc on the on the plastic and it'll hold it I'd in use two and I'd, I'd yeah. use more for that. I mean, you definitely don't want those coming out of yeah. there. But I, I haven't had that happen yet, so. Would you just run short on the Kiwis and you're running bungees here, or? No, I, okay. So the goal here was, the goal here was if these, if for some reason these fall out, Oh, because you didn't trust the kiwi. I didn't. Tr I didn't trust the kiwi that I would still have two fast mags that I could get to. I thought maybe use them designator for tracers or something. No. And that's it. There you go. And that's a current rig. We. we this still current make. rig. Yeah. Ah, ah. Anything to add? You hear my knees crunching? That's because <laughs> I carry all these magazines.